Welcome everybody to Usual Mike Television. Today there was an unboxing of the HasLab on Hasbro Pulse. Yo Joe June, the unboxing video from Hasbro was of the G.I. Joe Classified Series Assault Copter Dragonfly HasLab, the XH-1. Brought to you by Lenny and a guy called BMAC who works on Transformers. I don't know what BMAC's real name is. Well, let's just call him Barry. Barry and Lenny. <laughs> Anyway, they put down this beautiful, beautiful box art. It is glorious. It's very snug looking because they were saying how long the, the chopper is. Of course, the tail removes so it fits into the box nice and neatly. The tail piece had to be attached later on. It, it, it just, it will, it will be able to be posted to you better if it's to be put together. So the box does have sporting seven images of dragonflies all over it. Just absolutely amazing you could use that box and put the chopper when you get it sitting on top of it looks fantastic there are three trays on the inside of the box one has a dragonfly logo one has yeehaw champion wild bill logo and the other has the gi joe star the first box he opens up sticker sheet classic images there's zombie stickers there's blast effects rockets chopper blades fuselage the tails in there the lovely deco on the fuselage he's got wild bill's name a few things number 24 is on there very very nice lovely lovely they get to the second box it has the stand the base the side mounted rockets the strut to put the blades on the chopper and then they begin to build the chopper And they show off the, the blackout paint job, the articulated tail fins, the activation button for the lighting is on the top. They made a point about something called molded etching. It's on the blades and it's to make the, the chopper blades look like carbon fiber. Because you didn't set some of that detail was not seen in the digital images. And now that we've got it in hand, this kind of stuff is really nice to look at. It's like this makes the chopper look even better. So it does look absolutely fantastic. I'm just really, really impressed with how this come together. You don't need the blast effects to make it look cool, but they put it on there anyway. Just makes it pop. Very, very nice. Now, last box, this last tray to open up. Obviously, we've got the four characters in there. William Wild Bill Hardy. He's got his own little logo on his packet, on his, on his box that is number 142. Ripcord. On his but he doesn't have a real name, he's just ripcord apparently. <laughs> Night Force is on his packaging. Jane Glenda Mulligan. Now, if you go back and have a look at the history of the name Mulligan, there's a H in this one. There was no H in the old one. She's supposed to be Irish. She's Irish. That's the uh <laughs> That's her origin story. But originally this was Argentina and that uh Commandos Harios, I don't know how to pronounce that. It's the little logo on there. It's also on the back of the helmet you'll see later. David Crazy Leg Thomas Night Force as well. Very nice. As they individually went through each of them, Wild Bill rips out of the packet. He's got the hat with sculpted hair, uh, extra hair piece, extra hat in case you want to hold it in hand, aviator sunglasses, two revolvers and a knife. Looking fantastic. The, the sunglasses he put on fit really well. I was very impressed with how well those glasses fit on him. Lovely, lovely. Looking good. Ripcord. Ripped him out of the, He's got a rebreather case and an altitude gauge already on him as soon as you take him out of the packet. He's already, and also got that harness attached to him. Comes with a machine gun. His secondary machine gun. He's got the pistol. He's got a backpack. He's got goggles. Helmet and the rebreather hose mask combination. Now, when they mentioned it, they opened up his backpack and there's a little notch on there. And then they mentioned this. Right now, but. Oh, you guys might be wondering why there are two tabs in there. 
because um, this can hold on to threads. Oh, okay. If you wanted to put a loop on there. You wanted to get your own parachute. Say you wanted to put a parachute on it, you could. Or say maybe like a parachute could eventually maybe come from the G.I. Joe line. At what are you talking point. about? I don't know. What are you Just, talking I hear, about? I hear rumors. What are you talking about? I don't know what this guy's talking about. I don't know what he's talking about. Spoiler alert, parachute on the way. <laughs> that was it. Joking about they don't know what they're talking about. Yeah, we know. There's a, that's that's a hint right there, everybody. Something with a parachute. Look into the files. Let me know in the comments down below. Very cool. Glenda, Glenda, Commando Heroics. I butchered that terribly. Okay, one four four is her number. She has a harness that they pull out straight out of the packet, and apparently it fits all characters. They tried on Roblox. They said it's got adjustable straps and a repelling coil. It it's. So you can put any Joe in this and pretty much, I don't know, walk him down a mountain. She has hair with a headset. She has a new haircut. She has a classic hairstyle. She has a helmet with the writing on the back as we mentioned before. Pistol, ray gun, <laughs> ray gun backpack, and swappable hands so she can put some fist on her. Just what you need when you're flying a helicopter. Ready to punch someone in the back of the head. <laughs> Next up, crazy legs. Secondary straps already attached. They can be removed. The parachute rigger hat. The backpack, submachine gun. With a folding stock. Nice little touch. Knife, pistol, helmet, two goggles. One to fit the face and one to fit his helmet. The packaging, as you know, has a lovely matching packaging. Well, four of them. It's a lot like a wave of figures. They all match when they're on the back of the packaging. Turn to the side. It makes an image as well, like a mural. <laughs> oh, they've been looking over at the Star Wars team. <laughs> very, very, very nice. Very nice. Also, big question. When is it coming? Let's have a listen to what they say. Um. So I'm sure one question that's probably been streaming in the chat this whole time is, when am I getting my Dragonfly? Hit so um, I wish I had slightly better news, but to make sure you guys are getting the best product possible, there have been a couple delays, and Lenny's talking about the multiple versions we're getting in to yep. make sure it's right. Mm -hmm. So it is still coming this year. The time is to be determined, but it will be a little later than we had originally planned for late summer, early fall. Yep. So it will be in your hands before the end of the year. More to come on that. We will get a backer update email out, as we know, as cool. things start to align. But we yeah. want to make sure for the cost of this product, the size of the product, work. everything that you're getting, it has to be perfect. We don't want you to be unsatisfied. We want it to Correct. be exactly what you paid for last year. A hundred percent. And it's, it's one of those things where it has to go through those uh, extra steps. Just like every figure goes through those extra steps. It's just on this one, we've got to like be even more, more cautious than usual, which we, uh, my engineer should be putting a stained glass window with the amount of uh, <laughs> back and forth we do on these figures to make sure they're right. Um, in particular here to just, uh, you know, like echo what you're saying, we've got to make sure it is right. There's a lot going on. It's a vehicle and figure. So it's a wave and figures yeah. with electronics. So there's a lot of details. It's literally like six items in one. Yes. And it takes forever. A lot like, of product. It's a lot of product. But we, again, we want to make sure it's right. So that's right. You got to wait a little bit longer, but it'd be worth the wait. This looks fantastic. I'm impressed with this. I think most of us are impressed with this. This is a work of art. This is six inch HasLab at its finest. The Classified Series Assault Copter Dragonfly XH1. Beautiful. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And don't forget, in the description is links to merch, memberships, and affiliate links. If you haven't done so already, don't forget to hit subscribe, tap that little bell for notifications, slap a like on this video if you've enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. All the best.